Good day, folks. My name is Sean, and this is Air Photography. Today, in this video, I'm going to show you how to calibrate the IMU on your DJI Mini 2 or the original Mavic Mini. If you fly the Mavic Air 2 and you're wanting to know how to calibrate the IMU, you can follow along as it's the exact same procedure as they all use the DJI Fly app. I was out flying the Mini 2 a few days ago and I was getting some IMU errors, so I thought it was a good opportunity to film the process of calibrating it. That way, if any of you are wondering how to do it, you can follow along. Now, calibrating the IMU is actually a very simple procedure. It's not something you need to do all the time. You may want to consider calibrating the IMU as if you've crashed your drone or if you happen to notice it's behaving strangely up in the air. In those situations, it's always good to calibrate both the compass and the IMU. So let's just jump right into it here. We're going to launch the DJI Fly app. The first thing we're going to do is power on the aircraft and the remote like we normally do. However, when you do go to power on the aircraft, you do want to leave it in its folded state. Just make sure you remove the gimbal protector. So we'll go ahead and we'll power it on here. You can see everything is now connected, so we're going to hit the go fly like we normally would. And that's going to bring up the regular camera view. Now, if you're calibrating because there's a major IMU error, it will probably already come up on the screen that you need to calibrate. If you need to go in to do it manually, what you're going to do is hit those three dots at the top right hand corner. We're going to scroll down to where it says sensors, and you can see that's where we have our two sensors that we can calibrate. We have our compass and we have our IMU. So in this video, we're calibrating the IMU, so we're gonna hit calibrate. And basically what we're gonna do is just follow the on-screen instructions. So once we're in the IMU calibration menu, you can see here, I'm gonna get the aircraft position like they have it there. So once we're ready, we'll go ahead and hit start. And you can see there, it's now changed, and it's asking us to put it like that there. And now we'll flip it over. Now we'll put it up on its end. Now lay it down on its back. So now it's restarting the aircraft so we can flip it back over. We should get a confirmation here in a minute that it was successful. And there we go there. So with that said, we're now calibrated and we're ready to fly. Now, as mentioned right above that, we do have the compass calibration, and that's a very simple procedure to do. You can actually do that on the fly when you're out in the field. Some people like to do a compass calibration every time they fly. Quite often I do, uh, but definitely it's important when you're going from location to location, or if you happen to get any errors. Well, folks, that's basically it for this video. Just a simple video on how to calibrate the IMU. Like I mentioned, the procedure is exactly the same, whether you're using the DJI Mini 2, the original Mavic Mini, the Mavic Air. Even if you're flying some of DJI's older drones, like the Mavic 2 Pro, the original Mavic Air, you calibrate them in a very similar way using the DJI Go 4 app. Well, folks, that's basically it. Hopefully you found this video enjoyable and got some value out of it. Give it a thumbs up if you did. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you don't miss any of our upcoming videos. And we'll see you in the next one.